Hi everyone, welcome back to Queen G's Recipes. And today we are going to be making a delicious pound cake as you can see here. It is so wonderful, easy to make, only requires four ingredients, and it is just delicious and over the top. Now before we get on with the recipe, I just wanted to mention if you want to look us up on TikTok or Instagram, the links will be in the description box below. And if you are interested in any of the products that we have in any of our videos, any of the bakeware, dishes, anything that you like you will find everything listed on our Amazon storefront which will also be in the description box and our recipe is there for you as well so uh, let's get started with the recipe okay so let's start making our pound cake in a bowl you want to add in some softened butter must be at room temperature I like to add it in cubed because it's much easier to mix and now we will add in our sugar. And we're going to mix with a hand mixer until our mixture is light and fluffy. Okay, so you want to mix your butter and sugar for at least four minutes. Four to five minutes is ideal. It is nice and pale in color. It is nice and whipped up. Okay, so now we are ready to add in our eggs. Before we do so, I'm just going to scrape the sides. Now, I just want to mention before we add in our eggs, just make sure your butter is very softened at room temperature. If it's soft and still a little firm, place it in the microwave for 15 to 20 seconds and it'll be much easier to mix. We'll add in our eggs. And now we will mix our eggs just until combined. Okay, so our batter looks great now. You don't have to add any vanilla extract. I just feel like it adds some amazing flavor to a pound cake, but it is optional and just a regular pound cake usually doesn't take vanilla extract. But I am going to add some in because I love the flavor. Okay, so now you want to make sure you have your oven preheated to 350 degrees Fahrenheit. And now we are lastly going to add in our flour. Our last ingredient. Okay, so what I have here is a nine by five inch loaf pan, which I have greased and lined with some parchment paper. Okay, so my pound cake baked for exactly one hour and five minutes. Now I left it in the pan for 20 minutes and then I allowed it to come to room temperature on my cooling rack. You want to make sure you allow it to come to room temperature. Mine is still a little bit warm, but that's okay. I'm going to show you what it looks like on the inside. Okay, so now we are definitely ready to try this beautiful slice of pound cake. It is perfection, it is so delicious. It has a slightly crunchy topping and the middle is just soft and moist. It is perfection over the top and you need to give this a try. So that's about it. Make sure you give it a try. I'll see you in my next video. Bye everyone.